Hello and welcome to Lantern Sports Now, your source on all things Ohio State Athletics. I'm Ryan Velasquez, the Assistant Sports Director. And I'm Alita Jackson, the Sports Director. Let's take a look at the biggest Ohio State matchups from last week. The Ohio State softball team defeated Rutgers in a run rule victory on Sunday to clinch the weekend series. The 8-0 win for the Buckeyes is its 10th shutout of the season and lifts Ohio State to 23-11 overall and 72 in the Big Ten. The loss for Rutgers drops them to 17-19 for the season and 1-8 in conference. Ohio State's offense was powered by freshman third baseman Ashley Prang, who had two hits on three plate appearances for the day. Prang, who doubled in the fifth inning, started Ohio State scoring with her first career grand slam in the bottom of the third. In the circle for Ohio State was senior pitcher Morgan Ray, who only gave up two hits on the day while striking out seven batters in five innings to pick up her fifth shutout win of the season. With a 4-0 lead going into the bottom of the fourth, sophomore catcher Claire Nicholson hit a two-run homer to give the Buckeyes a 6-0 lead. The fifth inning saw freshman outfeeder Caitlin Kaufman also hit a two-run homer to see the victory for the Buckeyes. The softball team is back in action on Tuesday when it travels to Penn State for a doubleheader starting at 5 p.m. It's rivalry weekend for Ohio State baseball and softball as both teams take on Michigan and Columbus Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. The women's tennis team has a Big Ten filled weekend as they face Purdue Friday and Indiana Sunday, and the women's golf team hosts their spring invitational on Saturday and Sunday. The Ohio State football team has its spring game Saturday at noon to kick off the 2019 season. Also on Saturday, the rowing team competes against Michigan State and Michigan at home. Women's lacrosse faces John Hopkins at 1 p.m. And the women's volleyball team looks to defeat Dayton at 7 p.m. That's all we have for you this week on Lantern Sports Now. Be sure to follow the Lantern and Lantern TV for all your Buckeye sports coverage on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and Snapchat. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications for our uploads so you never miss another video. For Ryan Velasquez, I'm Leah Jackson, and thanks for watching this week's episode of Lantern Sports Now. We'll see you back here next week.